Jeremy, thanks for coming to Michigan. Thanks for coming out to the uh, con. Having a great show so far. Man, this has been incredible. We just kind of, uh, the I don't think the doors have even opened yet, and I think that I've already signed more autographs in the beginning than I normally do. This is fantastic, man. I love it. Talk about your experience with Mall Rats working with Kevin. What did that mean to you in your career? Well, I never would have imagined back then that it would lead to us, you know, almost 30 years later, all reuniting. It's turning out to be more um, important in my life than I ever thought it would be. You know, uh, this is the one that's not going away. It kind of yeah. seems to sort of just be, uh, it's sticking around. And I never would have guessed because it did so poorly at the movie theater that <laughs> this would be the one. But um, knowing Kevin and knowing uh, Kevin's heart and how, how hard he's worked uh, to establish uh, himself in, in sort of just the, you know, the, the, the fiber of Hollywood and sort of pop culture uh, has been such a boon for all of us, you know, and so I'm so grateful for Kevin Smith, you know, on so many levels, um, but I'm grateful for my family here and the convention family, and this, you know, this is a really, really nice group of people so far, man, uh, so Astronomicon is uh, stellar, I'm impressed so far, man, really impressed. Now, just a moment ago, I was standing back there, I witnessed something that happened, and I can't imagine it's the first time this is happening, you have a twin brother. Do people ever come up to you with uh, days and confused merchandise? Do you ever just sign yes. it? <laughs> yes. You know, if I can tell that it just means so much to them, and the experience is the same for them. If they think they're meeting Jason London and the guy from Days and Confused, and it means that much to them, and it's going to break their heart, and I can tell it's going to break their heart, <laughs> I'll just roll with it. But there's also the group of people that well that think that I'm lying about having a twin, and they, then all of a sudden they think I'm just a jerk. They're like, why would he? Why would you lie about like? You think you're so big, you don't want to admit you're in. The, I'm like, that's not me. <laughs> Read the credits. So I've had to deal with those people too. You're clearly better looking. You said it, not me.